Capturing the artistic beauty of Christianity, this Mother Superior honours God through more than just prayer. Before founding this convent, Sister Ephemija was a professional painter, and she certainly hasn't abandoned her talent. I think one day I want to have an exhibition of the work I did before I entered the convent, and of the pieces I made here, because the difference is interesting. In my work before, you can see that I'm looking for answers, and now I have a peaceful life here. And it's here at the Gradak convent in southern Serbia that she's found those answers. Two decades ago, Sister Ephemija discovered the abandoned monastery and felt a vocation to breathe new life into it. The example she set has attracted other former fine arts students to a life of religious contemplation. Some young women thought about entering an order, but they didn't know how to reconcile convent life with their artistic sensibilities. And then when they saw me here, and how I live my life, they wanted to give it a try. It pleased them, and so they stayed. Whatever artistic gift a nun has been blessed with, she can be sure of being given free reign to express it here. Sister Magdalena excels in painting religious icons, and she never tires of creating these pious pieces of Christian art. The more we paint icons, the more elusive they seem. This area is so vast. You can never say, I've mastered the technique of icon painting. A little modest, perhaps. The icons painted at the convent sell very successfully in Serbia and abroad. The profits provide nearly all of the nunnery's income, allowing the sisters the peace of mind to continue to paint and pray. <laughs>